Okay, so Mike, this time last season, Sale were struggling defensively, but so far in this campaign, we've done quite well. What have you and the other staff done over summer to try and tighten that up? Well, I think the reason I was brought in to have a look at that area, um, for me, first and foremost, I think the players over the pre-season worked very hard. You know, I was brought in to probably drive it, to drive the defence and put some, you know, put some systems and structures in place and look as though it was technically and tactically. And you know, the good thing that I found when I came in was that there's some really good material to work with here. And you know, I think, um, you know, like I said, the pre-season we built on the pre a lot of our pre-season was built on defence, and uh, you know. First few rounds of the competition, we, we, we've done all right though, but we still, we still got, you know, we've set some standards, but we've got to keep them standards high and, and build on them. What have you made of the lads as a group since you've come in? Are you impressed? Yeah, great bunch. I mean, God, it's a big club sales shark, and you know, you've got some quality of player. Here. You know, you've got your Quetos, you've got your Braid, Seymours. You know, a very good squad here, and you know, a little bit of direction with the defence stuff, and you know, we, 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 we're pitch paying dividends. But uh, as a group, the great group, great management team, and you know, overall, great environment to work in. You've won two on the bounce in Europe, good win against Biarritz and an even better one against Worcester. What, what do you think about Europe this year? Do you think we can go all the way? <clears throat> well, obviously the Premiership is, is the bread and butter. Europe is, is a good challenge, it's something nice, it's a different competition, it brings different challenges. Uh, but, you know, I, I suppose the further you go on in this competition, the more, the more eager you want to get to maybe the playoff spots. And, you know, it, we'll just keep ticking along nicely. First and foremost, the Premiership is our bread and butter, like I said, but it'd be nice to get to the Anglin and maybe hit them in quarter semi finals would be a great boost for us. You've pulled off a couple of upsets this season, Gloucester on the first day of the season, then Bath are a, a big team. How confident are you of another upset on Saturday? <clears throat> well, to be honest, the Gloucester game, I, I thought we'd prepared pretty well. I would never went there thinking we was going to lose. I always went there with an open mind that we could win the game. Uh, Bath at home, we've got to win home games. You know, that's, that's a given here. We, that's just the way it is. And this week we're playing against a team who, who, who've, you know, Whatever team they pick, they're a very good, well drilled, very well drilled team. They've got some really good staff there. Um, you know, this week is going to be a tough game, and you know, I'm not going to start shouting from the rooftop saying we're going to win the game, but we'll certainly go there with a the positive frame of mind of having a real crack at them. Cheers, Mike. Good luck. Cheers. Thanks.